Hello, Jamalf here and welcome back to Let's Play FTL, where my Game 4 continues in the Sector 7. Uh, it took me quite a while to go through this sector, uh, partly because my brain was frozen, but also because there was quite a, quite a lot of action. And there was a nebula, so I had a whole lot of time exploring the sector. So uh, let's go right back to that. Now we can jump. We can jump here, we can jump there. I think I will go to the middle. Again, I'm seeing, seeing more places. No iron storm here, but there is a terrified rock crew. Alright, with three shields. With three shields and some pretty insane weaponry. I might say. Because they are a rock ship. They have rocks. Um, I could put more guys there. To the odds. Follow, 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 follow. Ah, right. There are uh, blast doors here. Ah, oh, the missiles on the way. Right. Let's see if that. Hits. Shoot it! Nice! Okay, just keeping keeping an eye on eye on things. Their missiles offline. We hit their med bay. Let's uh, heal burst my guns once. Fan there. Okay, you 
two guys try to get in there. <laughs> oh, oh the fire. Wasted heal beam. How many times? Too many times. amount of scrap here in the, these uh, later sectors is it's, uh, it's just silly. Okay, crew. I guess I could upgrade here as well. I could take four shields now that I can afford it. On the other hand, I, I do want to have the 150 at hand for the possible cloaking device. So, uh, what do we upgrade when I when I think of it like that? Maybe drone power, so I can have that defense to up. If needed, let's put one, one to the power. Let's see where we can go with that. Then we have two power there and switch power around. Good. Okay. One more nebula. Inside this nebula, you detect a rogue planet drifting through space. On its surface, a huge monolith, visible at this distance even to the naked eye. A Zoltan Elder hails you from the planet. Through luck or intent, you have discovered the Great Eye. Look into its depths and receive your depths and uh, receive your just desserts. Okay, let's pull the ship closer. But the Zoltan. Uh, <laughs> Okay, and in the coming times, when the monolith speaks not with a man, he has no future and must be left wanting. Okay, I'm not sure if, th if that is a random event or uh, is there something something there related to... Uh... There's only two crew members aboard. They have uh, tons of lasers. Take that. Need to 
take that salt and shield down first. There's two, there's two heavy irons at the same time with the heavy laser. Well, enough, enough misses, and we don't take any damage from it. Not going to fire my missile on the. The shield. Now I can. On the other hand, why don't I just shoot the medical bay? Guys on board. Well, there's a fire. That's good for my rock man. Let's see if I actually send him in. Okay, that was easy enough. <laughs> Oh, they just got a hit in. Two hull damage. Oh well, maybe I can live with that. Maybe I can live with that. Maybe I should train my train my other other guys as well. I'm not sure if I can get them get them that high that fast, but right. More more scrap, just one place to jump. Nothing there for me, so I can upgrade. Upgrade to weapon system. Weapon system, and then I will jump this way. I can have to heal. Heal bomb ready as well, if needed. Okay, there is ship is ship is about to burst in flames. Let's leave before that happens. You receive a transmission. Sorry, sir. This is nothing personal, but we under. Orders. The rebel ship's weapons go hot. They have an anti-personnel drone and they have a med bay. I think I won't won't try to board them, especially when they are sending a boarding drone. They have free shields. I won't use a missile on that. I will uh, just. Put burst laser on their shields. All oh, right, that fire is from the previous fight. I didn't have, a, I didn't have sensors. Okay, you are heading somewhere in here. Nope, control, control. Did my burst laser just completely miss? Uh, I don't like the fact that there's a... That there's a hull breach there. Because that thing doesn't need oxygen and I do. And I don't, don't really care about... Uh, Drone control system right now. Burst laser fires. Okay. I guess it'll be like this. Let's 
blades with the burst laser for a bit that Halberd beam comes up. It's coming. To the shields. artillery beam um. oh this is this is good to too good to pass up mm, six fuel five missiles 36 crap yeah I will probably get less but no Well, nah, yeah, I got a bit less, especially when I got drone parts and not missiles. Uh, do I need to? Do I need to deal with that drone? Yeah. I haven't haven't really considered, although I, I won't change it now because Huts is, Huts is so drained in shields. Uh, the Zoltan doesn't have to be manning the station to power it up. The power power whatever room they are in. That's uh, that's something I should have considered when placing placing uh, him on, on there. He could have been a someone who travels travels to the room that needs the power the most, but. See how many of these places I can visit. This was a good sector with that much nebula. I've had a whole lot of a whole lot of time. You jump just in time to witness a Jolton ship's FTL drive overload. In their final moments, they implore you not to get involved, but it's too late. Their attacker is already upon you. There is two drones here. They don't have a med bay, but they have anti anti drone. They have that big missile that I don't like at all. Let's put the 
first laser there. I think I will go with the halberd beam. The defense. Well, actually, no, I don't need to heal first if I don't go in. Although, on the other hand, it's just one drone, I can probably handle it. So let's wait with the burst laser a bit. Good job, defense drone. Good job. Okay, I'm ready. Probably missed a couple of milliseconds there. Burst laser going in. Halberd beam following. I think I will go there. Nice hits. Excellent timing. Excellent timing. Let's send guys in anyway. Let's go to the pilot station. Not sure if their if their drone system is damaged enough that that, that that thing is not moving. Probably with these two drones out it is the case. Let's hold on to auto fire. Let's hold on with you as well, power to heal burst. Good job, defense drone. That's one guy is repairing. I will fire at the shields just to uh, in case I manage to hit them. Uh, I don't want to blow up the ship. So a minimum damage with the halberd beam, but damaging the systems and the guy. Still on the missiles. Heal burst. Oh, heal burst missed. Ooh, hoo -hoo. Again, why I'm not being more guys on board when I have the chance with my fastly, fastly regenerating. I had no idea. Okay, now I need to be careful. Fire him 27. Okay, that guy runs. Good. They run into this room. Alright. Now let's take... Just in time, the drone gets it. Nice, good fight. Good fight. Really good, in fact. Yeah, 
yeah, I need to, I need to, uh, need to start using this, uh, this other crew, other crew as well, and beam them on, beam them on board when it's the ten second, ten second uh, teleporter is so good that I, uh, I have plenty of time or the opportunities to do that. Uh, no store still, I think I can fit, visit all these places. One, two, one, two, three. One, two. It'll be close, I need to see after, after the jump what happens. Uh, yet another upgrade. I guess more power, maybe one, so I can have a have the defense two up when needed. I think I will put one point in piloting just to have that uh, additional buffer there again before it goes down. Let's keep on moving. You have to admit, Children's Space is a beautiful and peaceful place indeed. However, re-engaging the FTL and finishing your mission is your priority, not sightseeing. Nice planet. I'll take my chances. I think I might have to fight the rebels at the last one. Four shields. An automated scout. Only laser weapons. Heal post out. Helper beam out. Breach weapon in. Will I use it? Well, I do have the drone bots. It's not like I will run out of them, so might as well power the defense drone too to fire down some of their shots. Uh, I don't need the teleporter, so we can power that one up. Guess might as well. Right, the breach one to their shields. Hits. Does. I'm not particularly worried about their uh, about their weapons. Oh, I should have fired them. Should have fired the shields. Let's wait for that. can reach from there to here, good. Just to be on the safe side, let's add a couple of pixels there. Good. That will do it. Well, one of the beams will finish it. Alright. And I don't need to fight the rebels. How about that? I'm I'm not used to <laughs> used to having this much scrap. I think I want to 
upgrade the artillery beam if I can at least a bit. It'll help uh, help because it goes through all the shields and well, there's then some luck involved, but uh, at least there's something. Let's uh, let's put that one there. I might upgrade some power, but uh, I will I will jump into the jump into the exit beacon and then the sector eight. Use that scrap. Anything here? Even more scrap. Not much remains in this abandoned system, however, scans reveal a nearby mining platform with some salvageable materials. Well, that's good. Okay, that uh, finishes up sector 7. And uh, I'm going to uh, going to the last stand. Um, I wouldn't mind finding a cloak at the store in Sector 8, but even even without that, uh, I might stand a chance here. Uh, second phase and those will be difficult with the power surges and, and uh, all that if I don't get a cloak, but uh, relatively confident at least it'll be a fun fight. And so for that, join me again next time. Take care, bye bye.